Hello guys, uh, we're gonna be doing a reaction video. Uh, this, these videos are really, um, we don't usually do reaction vi actually we never do reaction videos. Uh, this is the first time we're doing a reaction video to a movie. Uh, the Amazing Digital Circus Pilot, made by Glitch, as you can see there, uh, I might as well subscribe. Because I think they're cool. So far, we're having some 19... Somewhere in the 90s graphics and some bloody music. Um, I might as well take down the subtitles. Uh, cool shit, I guess. Uh, it's no longer 19 sounding. Welcome to the amazing digital circus! Who the fuck is that, honestly? Uh, some, some random ass dude with a black hat, uh, fucking weird ass teeth, uh, some eyes inside of his mouth, I guess. Um, and he looks like a he looks like Willy Wonka, I guess. Except his head is weird. My name is Kane. I'm your ring. All right, that's fucking Kane. Cool. Master, and I'm here to show you the most jaw-dropping, heart-stopping, mind-bending paraphernalia you've ever laid your eyes upon. Isn't that right, Bubble? That's right, Kane. What the fuck does that shit look like? Um. Well, he's a fucking bow. He looks like fucking Chuck. Jump chain from fucking Mario. Can't wait to see what you got cooking up for today. Well, that's not. Hey, uh, what is he cooking up? Was he cooking up meth or something? Don't waste any time. Let's get right into the show. Sorry, Mike was muted. Um, what the fuck? This is I think it's like Gangle or whatever because of the fucking yeah. Um, she, I bet she always loses in rock paper scissors because. I think you can see why she's not on the fucking ribbons. What the? What the hell, bro? It's literally just a conglomeration of random shit, bro. Bro, what? Bro, bro made a pillow fortress. Bro, why the hell is he hiding in that shit, though? The show. Forgot to unmute my mic. This is gonna be annoying. Um, my opinion on her. Fucking voodoo doll, I guess. Whoever the fuck is that? Automatically my favorite character. Not the personality, but I just like how he's a fucking bunny. And also he's fucking purple, which is my favorite color. White. Purple. Bunny. Yellow. It's really an Afton! I'm calling you guys, uh, this, this guy is fucking Afton. He's William Afton! <laughs> Even the eyes! Just make, make it black? Make the yellow part bl black? Except for the teeth, make that black. Actually, make that black also. And just make the white, the, the pupil, I guess, or whatever the black stuff is, into white. Then you literally get William Afton's face, basically. What the fuck is that? Um. Oh, this kind of cough mode did not show up today. Oh, that's good enough. Um, I, I'm 
moon. It's the fucking sun! The sun and we don't know why! Who the fuck is that? Honestly, who the fuck is that? We didn't see her ass in the end. <laughs> Bro, it was really. Why? Why did I have to pause at this exact fucking phone? Now. Alright, this is. <laughs> if there was a big, massive shadow that looked like a, a thing, um, has already been five minutes, and we're only one minute, and, um,. Why is she looking up? Does she think? Does she see? Okay, fuck that. Oh. <laughs> G mod in a nutshell. <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Bro, child push William Afton push King, I think, push paper. <laughs> Sorry if I'm pausing this shit a lot. Kane, is this one of your NPCs or is this a new sucker? Bro, literally just roasted out whoever the fuck that shit is. Cause if it's a new character, we're gonna have to redo this whole theme song. He literally sounds like he's mentally insane. Just like Willie Mafton! I'm not doing that again. My my! It appears a new human has entered this realm! How do I take this? What headset? You what headset? You're literally what the f just keep what headset? Keep grabbing at it. That works for all of us. Yeah, clearly. <laughs> What's going on? I, I put on some weird headset and now I'm here. What the fuck? She put some weird ass headset. Who are you people? Why can't I take it off? Where am? You just have a- this character has just a skill issue, just take it off. Oh my. Let's just try to calm down. Everything's gonna be okay, new stuff. We've all been through this. Bro, why the hell she look like she's shivering? Yes. You just need like, to shiver me to What the fuck? Oh my god! What? No, 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 my dear, we- Bro, uh, Mr. Candy Cane, I think that was his name, he says, Well, you can't fucking- He can't have any of that foul language around- Okay, I basically can't talk then if I was in this reality. Down here, the amazing digital circus is a place to be enjoyed by all ages. You, my friend, stumbled into an incredible world of wonders where anything can happen. E except for swearing. How many times did you just say the B word on his I heard it. Yeah, um, oh yeah, <laughs> I basically can't talk in this world then <laughs> because I swear 25-7. Oh my god. And yes, 25-7, not 24, 25. Uh, well, how do I, you know, leave? Uh. Well, well, I think Mr. Candy Cane lost his fucking brain cells. Don't freak out about it or anything, but, uh, we don't exactly... You can't. What? Shut up, Jax. But, yeah, he's right. Welcome to your new home. And your new body. N a new home? What do you mean? Guys, don't be mean. We've been stuck here for years. Old Kinger over there's supposedly been here the longest. Oh, did someone say something about an insect collection? No, you swinehund. That's why he's crazy. <laughs> eh. I get it! This is a dream! And I should just play along until I wake up, right? Bro, why the hell does her skin look like she's a little fucking stick figure? Have... Stick figure, bro. What are you say, kid? Oh, wait, this isn't a dream. They broke my comedy mask. That's just a skill issue, a paper, Mr. Paper. <laughs> so, okay. Or Miss, I think. We having a new adventure. Jeez, Jax, Jax literally just reminds me of William Afton straight up. Like, literally, he doesn't give a fuck about any 
one's feelings other than himself. Who else does that fucking Afton? To today for the newbie or what? I'd like to give our brand new member a tour of the circus grounds first. <laughs> Off we go! Here we have the tent! This is where your living quarters are, as well as all sorts of other activities. These activities may include... These are my favorite activities, bro. My favorite. My favorite Ball pits, activity. mini golf, and more! What is and more? And here we have the grounds! Drown yourself in the digital lake or... Like... <laughs> Wait, we need to play that again. The grounds! Drown yourself in the... That would be my favorite activity, drowning myself in the digital lake. Digital lake, or engage in ridery at the digital- Bro, why is there nobody there? Little carnival! Night, day, it's all okay. The choice is yours, a cosmic buffet! Uh, is that all there is? Of course not! This is the void! We don't venture out into the void. Not even I know what's out there. That's- Wait, okay. Mr. Candy Cane is looking at that character and is like... <laughs> we he, he was just looking at her menacingly. Stay right here, where I can keep my hundreds of all-seeing eyes what on the, you! What the, what the actual fuck? Hello, Kane. I love you. <laughs> Get out of here before the moon gets frisky! Wait, what's that? <laughs> Whoa! Clean up on aisle you! I'm on it, boss! Ow. Kill me. That's disgusting. Ow. Why are you like this? <laughs> Even Kate is like, why the fuck are you like this, bro? <laughs> wait, wait! Who was that an exit door I saw out there? Is that a way to leave? What exit? If there was a way to leave, I'm pretty sure we'd have all left by now. <laughs> yeah, what are you talking about? Bro, bro, literally, literally had to choke a jackstone. Uh, uh, I, <clears throat> I assure you, there is no magical exit door. Bro, literally sounds like Among Us right now. You're probably just experiencing digital hallucinations! He's literally sounding like Among Us, bro. From your mind's transition to the digital plane. I, I swear I saw- Digital hallucinations! Bro's Among Us right now. How about we talk about something else? Like your name! My name? Uh, my name is... Uh, uh... Oh god! Why can't I remember my name?! Nobody can remember Just their name once they... Th that character just has a fucking skill issue, I guess. And to the digital circus? One of the few things I don't have control over are your minds. Skill so issue. all I can help you with is coming up with a new one! Uh, what's my name? Don't you worry your little head. Your new name can be anything! Hereby acknowledging that your chosen name and your names may not breach the digital circus user license agreement, stating that your name may not include objectionable content. Objectionable content includes but is not limited to sexually explicit materials, obscene, defamatory, libelous, slanderous, violent, and or unlawful content or profanity. What are ya? Bro literally was like speaking like absolute gibberish. Thinking! <laughs> Wait, one of her names was Longs? <laughs> one of her names was Longs? <laughs> she never said something about organs, well, sexual content, but never said something about like Longs' brain. I don't care, just pick anything. Let's see! What do you think of I think Xdidk is a good name. Xdidk. I don't You're right, terrible. Let's try that again! How was that terrible? It's good. What do you think of Pomni? Dog shit. Huh? Uh, sure. I think I just- God zooks you're right, Jax! We should have a brand new adventure for our new member, Pomni! He said that like five years ago. He yeah. said that like five minutes ago. You! <laughs> Do you like adventure? Activity? Wonder? Danger? Or pain? Suffering? Any disease? Uh, angel food cake? Uh, before the angel food cake, uh, actually I'd like angel food cake. Uh, yeah, I do like that. Even pain, suffering, horror, uh, danger, risk. Ow! You parasite! <laughs> uh, I don't. 
Broly would just call his own slave a parasite. Since you're new around here, we're gonna make it a simple in-house adventure to warm you up to how things work around here. What? No, God. I don't want an in-house adventure. Be grateful, little shit. Don't worry, Zubal. I'll make it something unobtrusive that you can still choose to not get involved with. Today's adventure is... GATHER THE GLOINKS! <laughs> what the fuck are GLOINKS? <laughs> That's right! The entire circus tent will be infested with GLOINKS! And you gotta catch them all! But what are they? I'm glad you asked, Bubble! They're small- And what do they do? They- and how do they- GLOINKS- Bro, literally had to kill his own slave. Some small, mischievous critters that steal anything and everything that- Bro, literally turned into a sticky magnet. They run into. Why do these humanoid hash browns do this? How do you stop them? That's for you. <laughs> you to find out. Did I just see the table no clip through the floor? Out. Now, good luck and have fun, my little superstars. Bro, literally did a Freddy Fazbear move. He literally did, bro, a candy cane literally did a Freddy Fazbear move. What did any of that mean? Oh, that's just one of Kane's little adventures. They're just something fun to do to, you know, prevent us from going insane. <laughs> <sighs> Speak for yourself. If anyone needs me, then f*** off. Literally me in a nutshell most of the time. Off. To my friends and they don't really mind. Oh god, oh please no! Exactly what I just said. Oh Oh no, they killed Zubo. <laughs> How the hell does uh Mr. Purple Bunny Man not care that one of his friends I actually I referenced him to William, so I don't know. Anyway, you guys wanna go get something to eat? Oh wait! We should go check on Kofmo. I'm pretty sure he'd like to meet Pum. Who the fuck is Doom Cough? Me. <laughs> impenetrable fortress! Why do you mean that's an impenetrable fortress? Literally, even even if I blow at it, it literally goes down. You wanna come with us to check on Kofmo? No, not really. I think Kofmo's gone insane. Last time I spoke with him, he was rambling endlessly about some exit. Kind of like you, Pomni. You might be going insane too. But wait, wouldn't that more likely mean the exit does exist? Could also mean you just have a jump start and losing your mind. I agree with this guy. What about Zubo? Well, I think... Nobody cares about you, paper string. Okay, I'd like to ask him about it, uh, if this was real, which it isn't, because it's a dream. <laughs> she still thinks this is a dream. Uh, why are you looking at me like that? I'm fine with doing whatever, as long as I get to see funny things happen to people. <laughs> okay, I've already had enough of these things. Bro, literally cracked. <sighs> you, me, and Pomni will go check on Kofmo, which leaves Crybaby and Hoo-Ha together to go handle the Zubal situation. <laughs> do you think pairing them up together is a good idea? Of course I do. They're the two most mentally stable and capable characters to be paired together. Come on, lady. He <laughs> literally just no clip through the floor. Let's go harass the clown. <laughs> what do you mean? Wait, what did he just say? Stable and capable characters to be paired together. Come on, ladies. Let's go harass the clown. <laughs> Come on, let's go harass the clown. Like, does he have a gun or something? My comedy mask is broken again. Absolute skill issue, paper string. Oh! Gangle, you startled me. Oh, my Gangle. So, this is where we all live. Or, well, where we all sleep at night. Even though we don't really need to sleep, it's sometimes nice to kind of take a break from everything and have a bit of a routine, you know? I'm sure there'll be one for... Oh, look, you already got one. I still don't understand. About the adventures... Why even go on them at all? Why not try to find a way to leave? Well, we usually do when we first arrive, but after a while you start to realize that you really can't leave, and constantly chasing an unattainable goal will start driving you a bit crazy. And eventually you get to asking what the point of anything is, and you completely lose sight of who you are and why you're even alive. And when you reach your breaking point, something really terrible can happen. 
that's not something we need to deal with today. Above anything else, the adventures give us something to do that keeps our minds healthy and stimulated. Thank goodness this is all a dream, right, Pommy? <laughs> Bro, what the hell? <laughs> Why are we here again? What are we doing? We're getting one of our friends. Just use, just, just use a, just use a nuclear bomb. That's how you open a door. Am I, am I correct? Or just use that clock that you got from Afghanistan. That is sus suspiciously counting down. Huh. Maybe he's not in his room? I hope he's alright. Don't worry, dollface. I've got a key to his room. Uh, wait, well, uh, why? You, you, you shouldn't have keys to anyone's room. Nah, I've got keys everywhere, and you've all been fine. By the way, I may have left something in your room today, so let me know if you find it. Uh, you're not afraid of centipedes, are you? <laughs> bro, bro, literally, bro literally just gave her her worst fears. X, that's literally my only fear. Why would you do this? What? It could be a completely unrelated question. You'll never know until it's too late. It could be an unrelated Unrelated question. I agree with Jax. What the fuck is that? Oh, I've been looking for this. Thanks for keeping an eye on it, Coffee. I'm gonna head out. See ya. Oh! Coffee's run! Been obstructed! Run, you schweinhund! It's okay? What is that? Uh, it might be that terrible thing I was talking about earlier when you reach your breaking point. Why the hell aren't they running? Isn't that a smart idea? <laughs> okay, wait. Maybe there's still time to fix them before we get Kane. <laughs> oh, whoa! Popmo, listen! <laughs> okay, now it's when uh, Pomni runs. I know we didn't always get along, like when you called me out for fake laughing at your jokes. I swear I really did think they were funny. I was just having a bit of a bad day! <laughs> Don't want to go. <laughs> the bro literally just touched electricity. Uh, I'm sorry! know what I'm looking at here. We saw Gloink carry one of Zubel's pieces down there, remember? Oh, yeah. Thank you for the recap. Boy, we're not very good at this, are we? Ugh, <sighs> oh, uh, okay. Uh, this guy is actually kind of cool, though. <laughs> he, he literally ran without consent. Like, he ran, and I... And we didn't even. Like, luckily he wasn't dumb enough. Fellas. Jerks! We found the Zubal hole. Cool. <sighs> How is Kamo doing? I hope he's not still mad at me for not laughing at his jokes. Oh, he's doing great. Totally. In fact, I don't think I've ever seen him this happy before. Well, it's good to know he hasn't completely lost his mind. He actually asked me to give you this. Oh! Bread. Bruh. Times two. What the hell is that? An insect collection? I it's called think a nest. It's a nest. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Ragatha? That was your name, right? <laughs> 
<laughs> hey, look. I'm... I didn't mean to leave you behind like that. I... Just... Look at my hand. I... I didn't know what to do. It, it, it's okay! <laughs> what you, you need to do right now is find Kane! <laughs> He'll be able to fix me up and take care of Kakafmo! <laughs> okay... But where can I find him? Uh... I don't really know. Just, just look around and call for him, I suppose. Uh... Okay, I'll get him. You just stay right there. Not that you can go move or anything. Uh, just hang in there. I'll be right back. I promise. Cool. Oh, so funny. I'm sorry. You're the first day here. <laughs> so terrible. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, don't worry about it. I'm just gonna go get Kane now. But we're really at the jump off of a cliff. At least I think. Of the Glunt Queen. Oh, is that who you are? You know, you could have asked for my consent before forcing me to see something so completely and utterly disgusting. <laughs> oh, despicable! A rabbitoid that runs its mouth in the presence of my royal figure! Well, as a royal myself, I would like to kindly ask him. Oh, look, there's Zubal. Hi, Zubal. Ah, uh, help me, you idiots! Kinda rude, Zubal. Now I don't want to help you. Bruh. No, oh, I always lose. Yes! Gotcha! Oh. Hey! King, are you mother... <laughs> Bruh. Eh, I'll be fine. <laughs> you bruh. <laughs> Bro, literally will leave after. Bro, as soon as bro, as soon as Afton notices that the children came back to haunt him. Gotta hide, gotta hide, gotta hide. Exit. Bro, is that like the back rooms level like one or something? Or well, level four, actually. But it looks like the back rooms. <laughs> assortment of colorful characters, do you not realize that everything must be Gloinks? I am Gloinks. You will be Gloinks. God will be Gloinks. This is dumb and weird. Well, but yet you're still watching it. I'm not here for the adventure or anything. I'm just here to hide from the... 
Bruh. Oh, thank God you're okay. You didn't experience a game show in there, did you? What? Uh, I... What oh. are you talking about? <laughs> What are those Ohio Don't worry effects? about it. Combo extracted? Nah, he's fine. You're right! How are we gonna get out of here? Guys, over there. Huh. Ladies first. No, wait, why would I say that? <laughs> Yo! No way, bro! No! Jit no, was doing that. Wait, Pummy's not even here? Wasn't this whole thing for her? Be quiet. I can't hear the escalator. <laughs> Bro, she is not. She's literally in the back rooms. know how to make me say this exact sentence. Yes! An alert on my wacky watch at this hour? Oh no! Someone's venturing out into the void! He'll get totally spoiled! There you go! <laughs> Rouge, she looks now like what she the heck happened around here? Oh yeah! My doing! Kane! Kofmo went through a sort of Kofmosis and abstracted! Kofmo abstracted? Why didn't anybody tell me? Uh, because you ignored them. And into the cellar you go! Wait, what? Man, I can't believe Kofmo just gave up like that. I mean, no offense, Kinger, but I always thought you would be next. Thank you. Guess it just goes to show you can't rely on Kinger for anything. Brett, I am in so much pain! Oop. What? I do have to apologize for lying about the exit. I knew how much all of you have been wanting there to be one, but, you know, I was having so much trouble figuring out what to put on the other side and ended up never quite finishing it. And you know how I never like letting people see my unfinished work, especially if it leads you out into the void. Anyway, looks like you defeated the Gloit Queen, so I guess the adventure's over. Your reward is a delicious digital feast cooked by our head bubble chef. Mm, and with all the love I'm legally allowed to give. Whoa, hold up! Blood could have literally put an illegal amount of love, like. Sex? Blood could literally put. Blood literally put a. Literally did sex. Because he said legally, right? So, sex. You know, I am pretty That's hungry. Scenario. You didn't even do anything. So what? I can still be hungry. I agree well, with Jack. Not really, because we don't need to eat, drink, or sleep in this digital world. So 
POV, you Q into CP dust ball. Oh, the digital food here only gives off the virtual sensation of eating without. POV, your homework is due tomorrow. Any of the nutritional benefits. Jeez, like... POV, your homework is due in one second. Often. Since when are you an expert on the digital world? Expert on the what? That scene just basically reminds me of every time I'm at a party. Um, yeah, basically me all the time in a party. The sensation of eating without any of the nutritional benefits. Jeez, lay off it. Since when are you an expert on the digital world? Expert on the what? Episode 2 when that comes out, it's definitely gonna blow up. Bye!